Hi all, I am Divya Sumakumar and in this video we are going to learn about polynomial regression. What is polynomial regression? Polynomial regression is a type of linear regression where the relationship between independent variable and dependent variable is non-linear. That is, we have a curvilinear relationship between our x variable and our y variable. Now let's look at the difference between polynomial regression and linear regression. We will also see why we prefer polynomial regression in certain cases over linear regression. So let's begin by first importing the necessary libraries. We have successfully imported our libraries NumPy, Pandas, Matplotlib, Seaborn and Warnings. Now let's import our data set. We have successfully imported the data set. I will provide the data set in the description below. df.head, let's run this. We get df.head. We have position, level and salary. So now, first and foremost, we'll divide the data set into our x and y. Our x is level and y is salary. So how do we write this? x is equal to df dot i look. We need all the rows. We need from first column up to the last column dot values. And y is equal to df dot i look. We need all the rows and we need only the last column dot values. Now let's split our data into x train, y train, x test, y test. From sklearn dot model underscore selection, import train underscore test underscore split x train x test y train y test is equals to train underscore test underscore split x comma y test underscore size is equals to 0 0.2 that is 20 percent of our data we are going to use for testing and let's state the random state as one now first we will do a linear regression and we'll see what is the problem with linear regression so now let's do the model for linear regression we have successfully run the model for linear regression. Now let's look at the R2 score. The R2 score is as low as 20%, which means that only 20% of the variation in our dependent variable, that is salary, is explained by the level, which is a very poor accuracy rate. Now let's look at the scatter plot. We have a plot which is something like this. We see that the red dots are our actual values and it follows a curvilinear relationship. But over here, we have tried to fit a linear regression and hence our accuracy is low. Now, how do we solve this problem? We solve this problem by using polynomial regression. How do we do polynomial regression? from sklearn.preprocessing import polynomial features. Let's define an object. Let's call it polyrec, which is nothing but it's an object of our polynomial features polynomial features. Let's call x poly. We will apply this polyreg on our independent variable. polyreg dot fit underscore transform. What do we transform? We are transforming our independent variable that is x. Let's call ring Lindreg1 equals linear regression 
we are making an object for linear regression linreg one dot fit what do we fit we are fitting x poly and y let's say y pred poly equals linreg dot predict what are we going to predict polyreg dot fit underscore transform x now our polynomial regression model is successfully built over here now let's look at the graph so we have a proper graph now over here our blue line is our predicted v, uh, y values and our red dots are actual y now our model is being able to explain the variation in y well now let's look at the r2 score our r2 score is 99 percent initially our r2 score was around 20% and now when we have fit a polynomial regression our R2 score has increased to 99.73%. This is the difference between linear regression and polynomial regression wherein whenever we try to fit a line in a curvilinear relationship we will get a very low accuracy and when we fit a curve for a curvilinear relationship or when we fit a polynomial regression, when the relationship is non-linear, we get a high R2 score, which is high accuracy of 99%. I hope why do we use polynomial regression is clear for one and all. Thank you.